Eileen and I are gonna kill this challenge. I'm here to win. Bring it on, babe. Guess I just ate her throw. Why are y'all talking about me and can't talk about it to my face? If you do an alliance, it's just gonna switch up. I don't go into your room and touch yours. No, so don't go into mine. Trust me when I say you're gonna wanna win this show. <laughs> How do you think you're gonna rank? I don't know, I feel like you know, they tried to get us low, and I feel like that's their little plan, but I don't think it's gonna work. I don't know, I'm a little stressed out about it. Michelle, well, I they told have their you. Little, like, squad, and they're yeah, all like, and their squad sucks. Uh, literally. I feel like I'm definitely placing high in the rankings, if not first. You know, I'm going for my third in a row. Who do you think's gonna be at the bottom? I don't know, I'm hoping just as a little, like, it's Maddie. Me too. And he's messing up his whole game and it's just so annoying. Yeah. It's like you could have been so perfectly fine with us, but now you choose. No, he chose to go against like, us. Go to mess up your squad. game for us. Yeah. For her? I got a text. Head to the living room to find out your rankings for last night. Oh Lord. Oh God. What? We're in there, girl. We're in let's there. Let's go, let's go, let's go. They think I'm gonna be at the bottom. Hmm. Y'all have a shocking surprise coming. It's time for a ranking. Oh my god, I'm nervous. Oh, yeah. nice. This is a hate crime. I knew it. I knew it. I, knew it. I wasn't even surprised because I feel like everybody just thinks of me like that. Hey. Again? Bro, why are you getting tired? And seven? What the f Oh my god. This show. I understand sometimes I can be a but I really don't think I'm that Hey. Another tie, another tie. Okay. I mean, I mean. <laughs> All I know is that I'm moving up in the rankings, so that's the only thing that is exciting me. Holy. Holy. Of course, I want to be first, but you know, my time will wait, I guess. Okay, Coley. Jay. Jay. You went up like seven spots. I need that kind of energy. Miss Ray. Ray. It's really sad. I can't believe that they would put me that low in the rankings. Like second, can you believe it? And that leaves you, Miss Girl. Oh. Yeah. Guess who's number one? The king himself, honey. As I should be. Let's keep it that way. HB King, how are you feeling? Um, I feel ecstatic. I feel like the next top influencer. <laughs> Ace King, he's being himself, and that's what I love about him so much. You just decided to share it you with know, today. Sharing is caring. <laughs> but am I the only one who got a text? Confident in following your influencer dreams, this, this next, next challenge, challenge is, is not, not what it seems. You have to make clothes or something. Oh, I'm not ready for these arts and crafts. <laughs> Good morning, Next Influencer crew! It's only been a couple days here in the Next Influencer house, but all of you have been doing an amazing job so far. Thanks, Owen. Our challenge today is called, But Make It Fashion. But here to tell you more about our challenge is our very special guest judge, influencer fashion and beauty guru, Mads Lewis. I love Mads Lewis. I'm so excited she's our judge. I feel like she'll actually pick the right answer, which, of course, is Ma. Hey, a and I crew. Yeah! So, for today's challenge, you will be using various clothing items and household items to create a new look. On Owen's count, you'll have 10 seconds to pick four items. You will have two clothing items and two household items. All the tools on the table are for everyone, so make sure that you share. And from there, you have 30 minutes to create your new look. Then you'll be having to walk the runway. So let's see those outfits. Ooh, okay. okay. Ace King, because you got number one in the rankings, you get first dibs on getting your items chosen and you get to choose the groups and the order they will go in. Okay, fair, fair. So come step right here and let's choose the teams. Right. I'ma keep the bulls off my back and I'ma pair people up with who they wanna be paired with. But watch your back, babe. I see all. All right, so team one, I'm gonna go with my girl, Ray. All right, Ray. Then we got Ace. Okay. And then we got Michelle. Damn. All right, who's team two? And then team two, we got my girl, Eileen. Hey. Mr. Eddie. Okay, Eddie. And then we got Matt. Oh, okay, Matt. And then the last team is Coley. Yeah, Coley. We got Jay. Woo. And then we got Maddie. Yes. And I'm feeling confident because my style game is 
always on point. Are you guys ready to go? Let's go. Yes. Let's go. After you walk the runway, Mads will be judging your outfits from best to worst. The winner of this challenge will get to make the decision of two people's rankings. Ooh. This is gonna be really interesting. Mads, any last words of advice before we get started? Uh, yeah, actually. Always remember to take risks and remember to be creative because that's the best key when it comes to fashion. Also, the people you think are your friends right now are your worst enemies, so watch your back and have fun. Let's do it. Okay. Okay. Ace, you get first dibs, all right? You have 10 seconds, and your time starts now. I just know I got this one in the bag. Okay, okay. Five, four, three, two, oh, I got one. The four, I got okay, the four, I got the four, I got team one, your 10 seconds start now. Ace, hurry up, hurry up. Five seconds. No. Just grab them, dude. Three seconds. 10 seconds, time is up. Ace, get out of here now, that's 10 seconds. I don't know what to do with all this. I'm really gonna have to think with this one out. Team two, ready, set, go. <laughs> Team two. I want this one. Why did I pick duct tape? What the hell am I gonna do with this Oh, I blacked out. Two, one, time is up. I'm actually pretty happy with the stuff I got. As soon as I saw that tin foil, I knew exactly what I was gonna do. Team three, go, 10 seconds. I have no idea what I'm gonna choose and all the options are like gone. I'm getting stressed. I don't have the pieces I want. I don't know what to do. Time is up, go. Good luck, everyone. Oh my God. Go. So I'm running inside. I have my vision in my head. I'm ready. Holy f these actually fit me. So I'm cutting this shirt right now. I just hope I don't f this up. Everyone seems like they have these like genius plans and I'm here with two beach balls and a white sheet. Is this too short? This is gonna be too short. Girl, too short for who? Y'all don't know what I'm planning, y'all don't know. I'm just looking, is that a poop bag? Like for the dogs? Matt, get your nosy ass out of here. This is not easy. Are you f***ing kidding me? I'm having a bit of a hard time right now. Like I'm struggling and time is running out. 15 minute warning. Oh, this is not cutting. So I'm trying to make a top out of this blue shirt, but like the way it's cutting isn't working. So I'm deciding to make a little two piece and it's gonna look great. I'm going for like the college party look. And of course naked ace is naked for the most part. Five minutes remaining. I'm just gonna keep the optimism. I need to cut more. Yes, bitch. It actually came out good. Time is officially up. Follow me, we are going to the runway. I hope one of these sisters don't pop out. That's all I'm worried about. I call this outfit the Shake and Jake. All right, Nikki Ace, I see you looking like you a Greek god. You all look great, but it is time to see what Mads thinks. Mads? Hey! Hello. So, first off, you guys look incredible, and you all definitely know how to rock a runway. You guys did so amazing, but I, I did make my decision. It was a little hard, because like I said, you guys did really good. But today's loser is... Matt. Oh, oh, nice. That was a surprise. <laughs> that was a surprise. You look great, but you kind of gave me a little bit of Aladdin vibes. I mean, I could bump you to the top if you want to take me on a ride on your magic carpet, oh. but I did not like the color contrast. I think the light green was a little too dull for the orange, but don't get me wrong, my friend. You do look great. A for effort. A for effort. For today's winner, for But Make It Fashion is, drum roll please, it's Rave! Yeah. What did I tell you?
tell y'all, winning materials. Come on. I bow. I bow, Rave. I bow. Girl, I think you look so good. I think the color is amazing on you. And I love the butterflies. Uh, sucker for butterflies. Have it on my hat. I think the purple looks great. And I think the choice of the household items was honestly amazing. And you did incredible. Yay! I'm kind of pissed that she keeps winning everything. Like, where's, where's my spot? Rave was literally just wrapped in plastic. Like, how does she even win? You all have worked so hard today. The creativity is amazing. So to reward you guys, we are throwing a party tonight. <laughs> but unfortunately, Matt, since you were our loser, you will be having to wear that to the party. That didn't make sense. She just like makes me more insecure than I already am. Like I'm already insecure. Like she makes me feel like such an idiot. She literally said I looked like a pirate. Like I'm gonna start crying. It's like annoying. Like you know what I mean. So after today's fashion challenge, I heard Michelle comment on my outfit which really brought me down. And I know I shouldn't let it bother you, but it gets to your head. Like it gets to your head when you don't have a following, when no one's really here for you. Like, it affects me. She's nice to everybody else here except for me. And all I've done is compliment her too. Like I just feel like these people take this so serious because they care about money and themselves and clout and that's not what it's about at all. Like, <laughs> I don't know, it's just like upsetting. Like, I don't know. Ace hey, King, how you doing, Ka? Good. Maddie, how are you doing? Great. I was just stalking you, look. Yeah. Like you, you dead ass caught me. Maddie is just a cool person. She's funny, she's nice, does not get along with everybody, but gets along with me. Maddie, do you know I cried in my confession? <laughs> we both cried today, that's not okay. Wait, you cried too? Yeah, oh. but I just cried because of like, I can't like, I can't, like I have to deal with my emotions. I'm having a really tough time today. One of my socials got banned and I am just out of it. I love you, please don't be upset. I'm not upset anymore, I'm good. I know I'm gonna get it back. I have positive people around me and it's good, it's good. I love him, he's such a genuine like king. You wanna talk about it or no? I mean, I was just saying how like I wanna help people, like that's why I wanna win this. That's literally why I wanna like be the next influencer because I want to help people with my platform because I never had that. So me and Maddie are having a conversation. She goes to tell me about her insecurities and she wants people to like her. Girl, friend to friend, just because you don't have the followers or the clout doesn't mean that you can't get far in this competition, girl. This is all about the influence you give. You have the personality. Keep these in check. I think the whole point of being an influencer is to like help people and like show them that they're not alone and like whatever they're struggling with. <laughs> and like for me, it's like anxiety and like OCD and like I just never am relaxed. I'm always on edge. It's just like mental health is like, I feel really strongly about it because it does affect a lot of people and it's not talked about enough. And I feel like influencers like have that platform and they have that opportunity to help people. My whole like reason of being an influencer is to like Make people, I feel like everybody deserves to smile. I'm gonna like, cry right now, you're so... No, like, I literally, <laughs> I, I just literally feel like everybody just you're deserves... You're so, like, sweet. Like, I just love you as a person. The reason why I'm ranking my girl Maddie first is because she told me the real reason why she wants to be here. And I wouldn't mind sharing the crown with her just this one time. Rave is going off right now. She's walking away with this competition, so I'm sitting my boy Eddie down and we gotta talk about how we're gonna rank her lower in the rankings because she's gonna win it all if she's doing all this. I think me, you, and Jake can do this alone, don't you think? Mm -hmm. Or do you wanna bring other people in? Because the moment you bring other people in, we're Once, if we were to bring Coley, she already said she's not forming an alliance. She literally called Maddie out because she wanted to form an alliance with us and she called her out in there. So Coley's out, Maddie, no. You cannot trust her, she doesn't know what she's doing. She doesn't know what she's doing. You know that. Jake will vote us high. We gotta vote Rave low. Or you can't tell anyone because if Rave finds out, Rave will be pissed at us. Oh, they're coming. Let's get out of here. I just can't believe my account will like get banned. Like, Your account got banned on TikTok? Yeah, and I think it's because of him, and like I just can't. Like it's okay. We're gonna we're gonna sort it out. You're not gonna have to worry. Your account who will get solved. Who do you think's followers or who's? I don't even want to mention his name while we're on. He's this for show. real. We don't. 
So that's why I've Stomp really been on sad. Him. I haven't been I haven't been sad because of like anybody in the house. I know. So I'm trying to, you know, just try to talk to everybody and kind of form some type of an alliance just so that way I know that everybody else in the house is on the same page. You know, I just want people to kind of just start opening their eyes and realize like this is a competition. Like we can't just hand it to somebody like I'm going to compete. And no, don't worry they about They think it. they're slick. Look at them. Look at them. Yeah. Eddie, we can see your reflection, baby girl. You're shady. What do you mean? I'm not going to let that comment go, by the way. What do you mean? The one what that you comment? made about kissing. Um, what's your name? I mean, you were the one that told me go ahead and kiss her, and I said, yeah, I'll go ahead and do it. Hmm. Did you do it already? Maybe off camera as well. Uh, all right, this conversation's over. Didn't make a move fast enough. I just want to let you know I'm proud of you because I got banned. That's my biggest fear in life. Mm -hmm. Like, that's the only thing I have, really, in my life. If I got banned, I would probably have a big sense eye attack, break down anger issues. But you know what, it's gonna be good. It's fine. Like, I Everything happens for I got y'all around here. So. Everything happens for a reason. It's gonna be good. We're gonna be good. We live and we thrive in. Avery's one of the nicest people in the house. He's basically the life of the party. He just brightens up everybody's mood. He's always positive and I respect him for that. I would be out of here by now. I'd have my mom come pick me up. <laughs> We have to rank her to the bottom. We're all doing it. Just do it. Yes. I'm sick of seeing her at the top. Me too. I, I don't I don't just want to know the winner. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's why. Eddie and Maddie went outside again to go talk. Ew. Yeah, honestly, talk about what? Honestly, I don't know if Eddie's a move, honestly. Eddie and this Maddie keep going out there. You know what I mean? Maybe they'll kiss or something. You agree? Yeah. No, but if I find out they kiss. Yeah. Mama's not gonna be happy. We've been telling Rave and Michelle like our scores, like where we put them, you know, on top, but they haven't told us where they put us. Me and Maddie are standing on the basketball court and it's looking kind of suspicious because we are like talking close and kind of quiet. And next thing you know, I see Rave just come crawling and then right behind her is Eileen. So what's going on here? Ball is life. Ball is life. So do you guys do you guys love playing basketball together now? Or what? We like hanging out together. I think Eddie's cute, but like Eddie and I are just talking, and I honestly feel like he's the only one I can talk to right now. He's the only one I can trust. If I make it right now, you gotta go with me. Do you want and me then, to leave? No, no, no. I'll leave. No, I'm no, not one not. here. No, I'm not one here. you can stay. Bye, no, enjoy no, your time with him. I want to go Maddie, see what everybody else is doing. He wants you to, he stay, wants you to Maddie. stay. Maddie's ready to go. I can see her. She wants to leave and leave me and Eileen alone. And no, I I want Maddie to stay. Okay, let me miss it on purpose. See you guys some a long time, okay? Oh, man. Oh, my God. That's horrible. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, enjoy Next your time, time together. What? What'd she say? Eddie really wants Maddie to stay, and honestly, like his energy was like really big. Like he literally said, "Stay here right now." And you know what? I guess this is just gonna be my sign to leave. Here's the thing: we cannot let Rafe get on top. Of her. Ace and Eddie's not gonna put her first because they know she's gonna win. Okay, so that's already two. And Coley's two. not putting her first either. Coley's not gonna put her first either. So that's three. If we put her ten, she's gonna figure out that I can't trust nobody in here now. So she either has to come out as three or two at the least. Cause if she like jumps down from two to 10, she's gonna know we all voted her 10. Okay, so I'm gonna probably talk to Coley. Who do you think you could pass the message on to? I'm gonna see how the boys feel about it. Oh my God, look at, look at Matt, look at Matt. He's messy. Matt must have some AirPods around the house listening in on us cause there is no way that he just found me and Ace in this spot right now. Hey baby. Stop it. Hey Ace. I'm about to be a man. I wanna act like. I'm getting What's ripped up, tonight. I'm getting ripped tonight, y'all okay. <laughs> I'm getting ripped tonight. Ace, just go be one of the bros right now. Did he put the hat on? <laughs> Stop. <laughs> He said, I gotta play an act. You're hilarious. My strategy in this game is just to play that dad role. You know, I'm gonna give you guys help when you need help, but vote me to the top, babe. That's probably your worst mistake. Rave could win. Huh? Like, Rave could seriously win. Yeah. That's kind of scary. <laughs> that's, they, yeah, like, they that's talk. That's really kind of scary. Yeah. Ace comes out, he's got a game plan. He immediately starts to tell us what's going on and he's even concerned about Rave winning the whole thing. And she's a really a good 
person, but like... She's killing it, bro. She hasn't done anything wrong. It's only been four days, and like, I'm here for a reason. We're all here for, for a, a reason. For a competition. Me and Eileen kind of did talk about it. And we're gonna kind of like, put Michelle first. Him? Yeah, yeah. He's you. you. I'm doing that. I mean, that too, I wasn't considering myself. <laughs> yeah, but now that you say that. But realistically, who has a big chance on winning and you do? Yeah. Now that I see that the whole house is on our side, we just have to implement this. We cannot let her win. Well, at least not this easily. You gotta put up a fight, girl. My is in his so freaking suspicious. You know what else? I was in the bathroom, of course, talking to hubby, and he's like, yeah, I'm just writing down everything that's happening. And I was like, I walk out and I'm like, oh. And he kept talking about it. I'm like, I'm like, I'm right here. Like, shouldn't you hide this oh, from me? We room with him. He loses his phone a lot. Yeah, 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 yeah. And you know what else? He wears one earbud 24 second. Like 24 seven. This whole time he only wears one earbud. And he told me he's like, girl, I need to like, lose the case. Yeah, at this point, like hide it. Let's let we should either hide his AirPods or take his phone. We're hiding his AirPods tonight. We are hiding them up and we should go to our room and and like just say some like just say some shit. like say some like oh all random you know what? We should start a fake like liners like say some fake like oh we're gonna get out like we're gonna purposely get this and then see if it travels back around somewhere like see if it gets back somewhere and it only go to him. Anyway, I'm gonna go pour the tea. What were you guys talking God, about? What? You know what we should do. Girl, I already did that. Copy, copy that. <laughs> no, come here, come here, come here. We were listening and Rave is gonna put Michelle at the top every day. Wait, really? Why? Because they're best. Oh, because they're rooming together? Yeah, she's gonna put her at the top every day. And the people she's picking, she's gonna put Michelle at the very top. That's weird. I wasn't a fan of Michelle. Exactly. No offense. I just so we need to put her at, we're gonna put her at the bar. Okay, we should go tell all the people. You don't need to convince me. I'm, I'm already doing that. Okay, oh, facts, facts. Okay. Whatever happens in our room stays in our room. How does it feel? Yeah, are you just like used to it? You're like, yeah, so uh, feel to have your name pop up like, first. It's definitely nerve wracking. It's just because I feel like people are gonna like start hating me because I'm just, you know, breathing. Hold up, did y'all get that? It's a good name. Oh, get uh, what? Text yeah, almost time to get the party started. Time to get into your best 2000s drip. Rave, congrats on your win today. You have one hour to decide where two people will place in everyone's rankings tonight. Uh, all right, y'all. Let's go get ready. I'll see y'all home. Good luck 2000s. with that, Rave. <laughs> so hype right now like Paris and Nicole have entered the chat for once everyone is getting along I'm somewhat scared but you know I'm just I'm out here looking cringy and loving it yo oh god did you guys get the text all right y'all we literally just got a text message it says surprise you have five minutes to Submit your rankings via text to this number. Please send individually. Rave has made her decisions. Jake must be ranked last. Michelle must be ranked third. Do not share your rankings. Let's get into it. Wow. We love you, Rave, but we can't let you walk away with this competition, so we're gonna have to put our foot down. People are starting to realize that this is a competition. Everybody's opening up their eyes, and I love to see it. Dude, I don't even remember everybody's names. Bro, what? Are you dumb? You know, I think I'm just gonna, you know, put Michelle third because it won't start that much drama in the house. And also, I need to be bumped back up to, you know, my place in the house, my home first. I'm putting Naked Ace. That translates correctly, right? I write Naked Ace too. Okay, is everyone done? Do you guys want to go in the jacuzzi? Woo! Woo! All right, let's do it. I'm gonna just make it loud and clear. I'm not going in that Hot tub. Where's Eileen? Where's Edward? Where's Matt? Matt, I'm not giving you back your air horn. Basically, I'm pooping and then I look out, everybody got in the hot tub already. What's that about? Unfortunately, I have crazy Polish parents that make me still go to school. So I gotta get that degree. Love you, mom and dad. 
Eileen. Eileen, baby. Eileen. Let's go. Where's Eddie? Go do a little red nose, little panoramic on him real quick and come back. Panoramic. Why'd you rank Jake <laughs> last again? I'm sorry, Jake. Not the boy, Jake. Why, why okay. did you rank him? You know, you honestly. Think, just because he can take it. No, I totally. Honestly, I, yeah, he's he's really think good Jake is the only one that would be, like, I wouldn't have to, not the only one, but he is one of the people that I know is the sweetest that would be able to, like, I wouldn't have to, like, hurt anyone's feelings. I feel like yeah, it, like, I feel like it would have been I'll me, but. I'm like, I'm like, you rang your ass and I'm like, not even bad. I'm like, no, that's not nice. nice. Jake to me. doesn't like, I know I wouldn't like, unless say I rank like, holy, <laughs> like, I feel like I'd have to hear about it. And I'd be like, <laughs> Eddie, everybody's calling for you. I'm not going in that fucking water. Literally, I, I don't want to be out there. I just don't want to be in any any part of that at all. Eileen, all this shit you're telling me is going through. One year going through the out, like, I don't give a f I literally don't. I literally told everybody to, like, leave me alone. My ears are getting red because it's too much, literally. <laughs> Where's Eddie? Is Eddie coming? Yeah, he's so At this point, I just think that Eddie's attitude is so ugly. Like, I don't even want to be a part of it. Like, he's really just pushing me away. Dude, I don't get it. They were tripping about me. Go in the pool. What the f***? What? Like, they all literally no, came No, I to heard me. that. I was sitting up I'm like, bro, I'm literally just trying to relax. I don't, I just want to chill. Like, okay, don't give me any attention. Just leave me the f*** alone. But dude, I just have to understand that this drama s***, that it's teaching us how to handle it how to handle each other the real is, life. All the drama is stupid. If anything, if anything, he's handling it poorly. That just shows how weak. Oh, well, yeah, maybe that's your man. <laughs> I don't know why Eddie doesn't want to get in the hot tub. I know he doesn't want to get in the drama, but that doesn't mean he can't have fun with all of us in the house. It's a good bonding moment for everybody in the house, and it's a good bonding moment to help our rankings. Hey, Dada. Hey, guys. Yes. He's just mad because you guys, like, called him dumb for not going in the hot tub. It's so what? stupid. It's so stupid. That's the thing with him. It's like one thing goes wrong, his life is ruined. Wait, I didn't say I'm mad. I just said y'all were in, like, I don't even. Care. Man, I'm annoying, dude. Like, I can't stand him, bro. Literally just trying to chill. Ace, baby, what happened to you? I can kill me. I don't know. Like, I actually don't know. I wish I knew, and I would tell you, but I don't know. But, oh, that, like, when A's, bro, oh my god. I need water. Can I go outside? Yeah. I can't. Same thing. This is a challenge called DI Why Not. Oh. This is gonna be a cakewalk. Doggy, doggy position. Again, were you in the conversation? Damn, What's now I hate her. My roommate! Wait, what? I did that? Stop apologizing to me! I'm not playing sweet Coley anymore. In this competition, it's everybody, and it's you're on your own.